Hello everyone. Today we have chosen a very interesting question which is uh, area volume of 3D shapes and we need to uh, go through this question. This is a cylinder and a sphere water is there inside the cylinder. We'll be, go through, we'll be going through this question um, but you need to practice these questions a lot because these are complicated questions and they, these type of questions require a lot of practice. I have uploaded a lot of videos and you can go through those videos. This is uh, uh, um, around 10 marks or more than 10 mark questions and these are uh, very important. You know 10 marks are very important for IGCSE students so you need to practice these uh, questions a lot. Diagram provided is not to scale. The diagram shows a cylinder containing water. There is a, a solid metal sphere touching the base of the cylinder. Half of the sphere in is in the water. So half of the, this is important, half of the sphere is in the water. So it means we will take hemisphere. So we will take this one, this half of the sphere is inside the water. So this will be volume of the hemisphere. So next they're saying the radius of the cylinder is 12, which is uh, this one, 12 centimeters. And the radius of the sphere is three centimeters. So if we check the radius, the radius of the sphere we can take like this one this is three centimeters so three centimeters then they're saying the sphere is removed from the cylinder the sphere is removed from the cylinder and the level of the water decreases by h so decreases h and before removing the height of the water is three centimeters show that h is equal to 0 0.125 and the formula for uh, uh, volume of sphere they have provided 4 over 3 pi r cube so first of all we will check the volume of hemisphere so volume of uh, hemisphere will be equal to half into 4 by 3 pi r cube and you know r is 3 so we'll take 1 by 2 4 by 3 pi and 3 cube and this will be equal to what we can take 0 0.5 into 4 over 3 into this one pi and 3 cube and this is equal to 18 pi so hemisphere volume is third 18 pi now uh, we need to show that the um, now when we will remove this hemisphere uh, this will be volume of the cylinder will be decreasing so this much volume from the volume of the cylinder will be decreased so we will check volume of the cylinder volume of cylinder is equal to we know that pi r square into h so pi r square into h and pi into r radius of the cylinder is 12 centimeters which is uh, provided so we can take this one as 12 square and into h which is 3 so we'll check this one and this will be uh, 12 square into pi and multiply by 3 as well so 432 432 pi so this is volume of the cylinder now um, volume of the cylinder um, when we remove the hemisphere so pi r square h will be uh, now new volume will be what new volume new volume after removal of this uh, hemisphere will be 4 by 3 4 no 432 pi minus 18 pi this is the volume of the hemisphere which we are removing from the volume of the cylinder so you know, this will be equal to what this will be equal to 432 
pi minus 18 pi and this is equal to 414 pi so 414 pi will be the volume now we know that the radius is 12 so we can find at new h so this will be 12 square into h is equal to 414 pi so h will be equal to 414 pi and this will be divided by uh, 12 square pi and this will be equal to we can divide this so this one answer divided by 12 square and this will be pi and this is equal to 23 by 8 or decimal value will be 2.875 2.875 this will be new height now they are saying that uh, show that height is equal to 0 0.1 so decrease in height decrease in height this is the height which new height will be of the water so decrease uh, uh, decrease in height decrease in h will be equal to 3 it was originally 3 and minus 2.875 and this will be equal to 3 minus answer is equal to 0 0.125 0 0.125 and this was the requirement h is equal to 0 0.125 which we have proved hopefully you understood this now for the B part, B part says the water in the cylinder is poured, water in the cylinder is poured into another cylinder of radius capital R. The depth of the water in the cylinder is 18 centimeters. Calculate the value of R. Now volume, we know volume is equal to what? Pi R square H volume of the cylinder and volume is 414 pi which we have calculated over here 14 414 pi so this will be equal to pi r square which we are now in this case having capital r square and h will be height which they are saying depth of the water is 18 centimeters so we can take this as 18 so r square will be equal to 414 pi and divided by 18 pi and this will be equal to we if we take if we take r over here and square root of 400 414 pi over 18 pi and we can calculate this so this will be square root of fraction 414 pi over 18 and pi and this will be giving us under root 23 and decimal value will be decimal value will be 4.795 4.795 or we can write 4.8 as rounded to one decimal place this is the answer for the marks now for the c part the sphere is melted down and some of the metal is used to make 30 cubes with the with the edge length of 1.5 so 1.5 edge length so all the sides are 1.5 calculate the percentage of metal not used percentage of metal not used wording is very important you have to keep in mind and the volume of the sphere with radius r is given formula is given 4 by 3 pi r cube so volume of sphere which we have already calculated 18 pi was for hemisphere so 2 time hemisphere will be 36 pi so we can write this as 36 pi and next volume of 30 volume of volume of they are saying 30 cubes 30 cubes will be equal to 1.5 cube this is a cube we are taking a cube for yeah, volume of the cube so multiply by 30 will be equal to how much this will be 1.5 cube and this will be multiplied by 30 and this is giving us 101.25 
101.25 this will be centimeter scale now uh, unused one unused portion will be what total is 36 pi so 36 pi minus 101.25 so this will be equal to 36 pi minus answer is equal to 11.84 um, 11.847 so i will write 11.85 now we can um, we can write basically the percentage of volume which is not used this is unused volume volume is in cube so this will be cube okay now we are uh, use unused one percentage of unused one 11 point we can write here percentage of unused metal and this will be 11.85 divided by 36 pi 36 pi and multiply by 100 and this will give us the percentage so this number and we can take over here and divided by 36 pi and multiplied by 100 and this will give us 10.475 10 10.475 or we can write 10. Point Five as our answer percentage and this is three mark question uh, percentage um, these topics you should revise because always they are giving combination of different topics in one question so percentage concept is used in this and plus uh, volume of cylinder and volume of sphere and comparison of those volumes and calculation of those volumes is use this concept and hopefully you understood this if you like this video and want to have more videos of this type then subscribe the channel and press bell icon so that you will be getting notification for incoming videos as well and recommend this channel to your friends and class fellows and introduce this channel to your respective teachers thank you very much for watching take care bye